Welcome back. Take two. Somebody tried to FaceTime me during the first video. Um, wanted to do this quick video because on my last one that I posted, it was a new finds video, stuff that I had just recently picked up. And uh, I completely forgot about one thing. And um, I wanted to make sure I got it out there. And um, just so a uh, little backstory, I guess, is I come home from work one day and my granddaughter's in my living room and she's painting. And uh, I just happened to see in the colors she was using and stuff kind of rang a bell in my head and I was sitting there thinking about it. And it was like a light bluish green type color. And I just, I remember recently seeing um, some coffee mugs, Abbey Road coffee mugs with the same colors. And that's what it reminded me of. So I sat down and talked to her and I asked her, you know, if she could do something for me and so forth and so on. And long story short, she did. She finished it. I don't even, you know, understand the process of behind what she did to do this or anything. Because I ain't no artist. But um, what she did for me is this. And... I personally think it looks great. I love the way it looks antiqued. Um, I love the colors behind it. I love the way it fades in. And it's on canvas. It's a painting. Okay. And I know that the picture is mirrored. For all you diehard collectors, you know there was... When they took the Abbey Road uh, screenshots, they took them from both directions. You know, crossing the street. And um, the picture, she printed it offline... When you put it on the painting, it comes out backwards, which that's why I chose Abbey Road. It doesn't matter because, you know, but, um, yeah, she, she did a phenomenal job. I think it's hanging in my beetle room, but for the people that have not seen it, the, uh, I have an HMV CD box that where they're actually walking the other way, walking the other way. And if you notice, Paul's even wearing his sandals in this picture. The traffic's different. I mean, everything. So, but just as a comparison between the two pictures. But, yeah, she uh, she made this. And um, one of these days, hopefully I can get her in a video. If you're interested, she can explain the process behind it. You know, I know she's making um, various different other stuff for other people and so forth and so on. But... I just wanted to get it in there. So thank you for watching and till next time.